<laughs> All right, here in the Mayweather Boxing Club with amateur boxer Tina Rahimi. First of all, uh, Tina, first time here to the Mayweather Boxing Club, I believe. What's it been like so far for you? Um, it's been really, really good. Um, I enjoy it a lot here. I feel like everyone's very friendly, um, very nice, especially coming from a Muslim background and wearing the hijab. I don't think you see many of us walking into the gym. Um, but yeah, I really enjoy it here. Good trainers, um, good, very friendly people. Yeah, yeah we'll get to the, to the Muslim part in a second, but I believe you have 10 amateur fights or so. So you, but you've been here, you got to, to meet people like Layla McCarter, eight-time world champion, got to work with Jamie Mitchell. What's, what's the talent like of the, of the ladies and, and the men that you've been able to meet here? Yeah, it's, uh, everyone's been really cool. Um, I got to spar, um, what, Jamie, what's her name? Uh, Jamie Mitchell um, and a Japanese um, WBO world champion. Um, what was her name? Miso? Yes, Yoshida Miss. Yoshida Miso, I think that's her name. Mio, yeah, Mio Yoshida. Yeah, um, yeah, it's been really, really good. Yeah. And then yeah, I saw it today. You got to work with with, with uh, Mayweather, right, Jeff yeah. Mayweather? What was that like? Yeah, it was really cool. Um, yeah, um, with hard work. <laughs> you have. <laughs> I, I I I said a couple times when you were doing it. You you probably have more energy, I think, than anybody I've ever seen. What is that part of the the key to your success? You think that you you've got so much stamina and and, and uh, rambunctiousness, I guess. Well, I always like to keep pushing, even though when I'm tired. I don't like to look tired. Um, maybe sometimes I do look tired, but I always like to push. Um, yeah, 100 percent during every session. Yeah. So you have, tell us a little about your amateur background and then your plans going forward uh, to moving to the pro ranks. Yep. So I've had um, 10 amateur fights, um, had 8 wins and 2 losses. Um, the One of the losses I lost by split points decision and the other loss um, I fought the girl again and won on the rematch. So yeah, um, I am looking to go pro um, in June, hopefully this year. Um, yeah, I've, I fight out of um, a gym called Sydney Fight Gym in um, Sydney. And yeah, my coach is um, Shadi Chabib. Yeah. <laughs> so who are some of the ladies you've looked up to, either uh, active or, or in the past? Um, I like Clarissa Shields. I like the way that she fights. Um, I like um, Sinisa. I've, do you know Sinisa um, Estrada? Yeah, yeah. She's really, really good. I got some sparring rounds in with her in, um, when I was in LA last week. She's really, really good. I like her style. Um, yeah, I don't really follow anyone, like, I, I, I usually just look at, like, fight videos and stuff. I don't really look up to anyone like that, but, yeah, I like to, I like to see how they fight, yeah. All right, so you alluded to it earlier, I don't know many Muslim women fighting. Uh, how, how did your, well, first of all, how did your family embrace that? I mean, you said, hey, I want to go start punching people. How did, how did that work? Um, well, my dad comes from a... Um, MMA well wrestling background so he was doing um, wrestling for many many years actually he was like Australian champion um, European champion so this is back in like the 80s 90s um, so they, they, I guess they're okay with it um, my mum well she lives in Melbourne now so um, I don't really have contact with my family um, that much but they're okay with it they just said watch out what you're doing um, but they believe in me so yeah so, so correct I mean Excuse my ignorance on, on the Muslim faith. I should know better, but but are are, are you supposed to not be fighting, or, or clarify that? Um. Well, no, not. Well, I don't know what it's supposed to really be like. Um, like Islamically, I don't think. Why not? Do you know what I mean? Like, I think I think just the um, mixing with like the the men and the females. Maybe it's not that right. But my intentions are pure. Like I'm in it because I. You know, I love boxing, I love, I just love the sport, so I'm just in it to bash people. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, so, um, but from an Islamic faith, it's, it's really, um, yeah, a lot, of, a lot of women are not into it. I think more, the men might find it a bit, I don't, I don't know what to say, but yeah, probably not, they don't like it. I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> well, you haven't even had your first pro fight yet, but do you feel like kind of like a role model maybe for other young uh, Muslim ladies that are, are maybe looking to do something like this that felt they couldn't before? Yeah, yeah, I, I think 100% go for it because um, it, it boosts your confidence, um, especially when you're around, um, I don't know, I, I feel like ever since I started boxing, it really, really boosted my confidence. I mean, I used to get a lot of stares from people and looking down on me because I wear the hijab, um, and I feel like if anyone wants to muck around with me, <laughs> like, don't start. Nah, but, um, but yeah, I just feel like 
yeah, any any young female um, Muslim ladies that want to get into the sport, I feel like it, it definitely is a, a good option because it definitely boosts your confidence and yeah, just just for self uh, self defense as well. It's really really cool. How does that work in the fight wearing the hijab? Is it uh, first of all, do any places say you can? And I'm assuming, or if you have, what kind of uh, obstacles does it create for you as you're fighting? Um, I would say that it does sometimes slide off a little bit, so my hair is not supposed to be like showing. Um, it, it, it's it's okay, I guess. Um, I just have to wear like long sleeve, um, my clothes. Um, I don't really, I don't mind it. It just doesn't really. I get a lot of stares because you don't see a lot of like Muslim um, women um, that do boxing, but I, I enjoy it. Like I don't mind it. Like I'm, I am who I am. Like this is my my choice. So um, yeah, I guess yeah. It doesn't. Apart from it sliding off a bit, there's no really really any obstacles. Yeah, I don't care what anyone thinks. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's been a blast having you here, and we're looking forward to your pro debut. Where can people that that want to keep up with you? follow you on social media? Um, so if you just add me on Instagram, um, my Instagram is Tina, T-I-N-A-R-A-H-I-M-I, -I, um, I underscore, so Tina Rahimi underscore with two eyes. Yeah, yeah, put it on there. <laughs> follow me on um, Instagram, watch out for my pro debut, um, and yeah, looking to be world champion. Watch out. <laughs> All right, best of luck, enjoy your time here. Thank you. Thanks so much.